And of course, uh, who is Veronica's Kirby role model? Diana Bahati. <laughs> I would uh, reason as to why uh, probably you love Diana Bahati and she's your role model. So um I've been watching Diana from Kitambo to ile ile reality show ilikuwa in TV. Yes. So I loved her from there the way ana ako nimkoa na meet wake like ako na to rosa me nimkoa unezona kazi yeye anafanya pia una admire yeah, sure, sure. eh, so ndio maana nampenda ah uh, so you, you love her when it comes to evo unajua role model ni wengi maybe unamwangalia in terms of career ama in terms of nini to be specific in terms of career na her personality her personality and also the way she is as uh, Diana Bahati of course Vero went on aka post pale TikTok aka you know what guys uh, yeah me Diana Bahati is my role model and of course people don't understand that role model si lazima atoke kwa familia and how was it that people are asking kwani you can't choose your sister in law mili You know role model hata si lazima kwa kwa country yenu. Ju hata pia anaweza sema role model wangu ni Obama ipo. So it's not a must. Tunajua I guess maybe because she's anajulikana watu wakaona ni kama competition you see. So ni watu alileta tu competition but mimi niliweka tu ju I love that. Yes, yes. Maybe clear the issue eh, part here that not was if kire oh sijui mili I, at the reason I say could choose mili na nini maybe just clear to them as a top. So um <laughs> <laughs> So when you ni mesema role model si wa country yako ama familia yeah. and that's why I chose the Anna Bart because I love her so much. Mm. Mi tunampenda. Na ile kazi anafanya na vile tu anakonga tu rosa. Tunaanga acha yeah. how she relates with everybody. Yeah. Eh that's why William Chagua. Mm. Okay, leaving that behind. Talking about content creation. Tunaona pale you have a YouTube channel where you mostly do cooking. Yeah. What inspired you to start a YouTube channel? So nimekuwa nikitaka kupika from a very long time so kata nikiwa mdogo mm-hmm. and I see that on my YouTube channel yeah. I love baking so much uh-huh. and so my parents wakaniambia so uinge nini YouTube because mm-hmm. the first thing I started with was Instagram because oh, yeah, hapo ndio eh, kwa IGTV yes, so hapo ndio nilikuwa na post so wakaniambia yeah. jaribu YouTube because pia inalipa yes. unaweka inaochiwa and you get it mm-hmm. Ah and so now from that ndo kanza kujaribu how has it been so far and uh, are you uh, is your brother and Mili supporting you when it comes to that um <laughs> it's a kwa mbaya cuz lazima ungangane sure. unajua it's always be a tegemea your brother or your sister sure, yeah. na usha kwa mkubwa so unachitafutia mm-hmm. tu Ah uh, maybe the future when it comes to YouTube ni kupika tu na kutuanisha recipes zama itakwaje No sitakuwa specifically kwa kupika na recipes I mm-hmm. will so be doing maybe like yangu like vlogging too yes, yes. of my life eh. Oh okay that's nice Na unajua tunasema anga odako haitaki uzembe kwa hii content creation yetu Um kulikuwa na ish ish pale mtandaoni online uh, people were talking wanasema Vero ameka TikTok ingine showing that she is not okay i don't know how is it that people are saying that probably um, that is the alleged allegations that were going on uh, around social media they were saying that probably uh, the family of Vero it's not okay yani venye we are seeing that a uh, family akina mili maybe wanajengewa her side that is her mom and on this other side we are not seeing the same so kuna kuna allegations going around on social media uh, they are, they were they saying that are you guys okay yani your side when it comes to the kabis side eh uh, sit kwa you know when you stay with god and your parents are still working hard so sia tunashida yote Mm-hmm. So the allegations that were going around that it's like you guys have been neglected and yet maybe they are concentrating on the other family it's not true. Um Unajua hiyo ni watu walisema si si si. So yes tajibu. Utaona unyamazi hapo. Okay, the thing is just to clarify if you guys are okay or 
ni hizo tu watu wache kuongea. Ah oh, si tuko poa. Mm. Mm. How is mom by the way? Mom wako poa. Mm -hmm. Kokoa kabisa. And on, and also clearing on the allegations, uh, people were asking what is your relationship? Are you guys okay with uh, when it comes to Mili, your sister in law? Eh. You talk to her most of the time someone in London. Ah uh, matonge yangu sana mm. cuz unajua watu wako busy. Sure. Eh yeah. so mimi nimekuwa shule mm. maybe yeye kuna kazi yake so kuongea mm. si sana. Mm. Eh. So people should stop on the allegations that uh, you guys have been neglected because there was was there some time uh, you posted that TikTok but ilikuwa in Kikuyu maybe lip singing ama sijui ilikuwa nini. Oh I guess ni mamangu. Yeah, I think it was your mom and then people translated like any she was kind of advising maksema mtoto akienda kuolewa asisahau fa kwenye ametoka. You know she was just giving advice out here mm. juu. Unajua hapa ya maybe uko nje kuna mm. watu wako hivyo. Sure, eh, yeah. so mm. ilikuwa tu kupeana advice. Okay, na advice but nothing more. So people should stop on the allegations when you are on a TikTok akisema mara milini mbaya nini. <laughs> Unajua watu wataongea you can't control them so yeah. ah okay that's nice moving away from that what is your take when it comes to a uh, in-law relationship mother ma mother in law and the son relationship what is your thought on that do you think we should go back in the days where tulikuwa tunapeana anger distance or people should embrace for me i choose respect jo kuna place unapaswa ku a respect ata kama you saying about dated and everything i think it's good you put that respect ju una job na nazingine ones zinatokanga mali unadhani ah hapa hiyo kitu ilishanga na ujui eh na ukumbuke pia watu sahihi at kila mtu ameingia hiyo digital so eh also according to you we should um, to to back in that respect that we used to we should put some boundaries oh okay nimeuliza hivyo kwa sababu si uliona ile yenye ilienda online wakisema kabi was dancing with the mom in law sana uliona okay moving away from that sasa uh, you are now in school do, uh, doing that science utamaliza lin i guess 2027 Ah 2027 that's when you'll be done. Na umesema unataka kwenda majo. Eh I want to go to Nairobi. Eh to ime kwa dream yangu kutoka kitambo. Yeah. Ah maybe celebrity crush when it comes to Veronica Kabi. Celebrity in Kenya. In Kenya. Oh yeah me. Celebrity crush. Maybe I always love Kenya. Oh, hebu tuambie mbona unapenda Kinothia. Aki Kinothia na konga. Ni kama sitaki sije ni sema kama Diana, Roho tu safi. Kwa hiyo unaona nanga like hapo ni ile passion of content creation. Eh. Oh, okay. Any person or uh, a public figure they would love to work with, collaborate with, uh, maybe can I watch? ndaya na bahati obviously okay. <laughs> even kenothia mm -hmm. um na mtu mwingine kweli because those are the people in nairobi they hey, love nairobi so nairobi. much mm. Mm. nairobi if you are watching nairobi, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nairobi. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh okay 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 that's nice when it comes to youtube fans we expect more and more of uh, vero eh hey. maybe you can tell them uh, where to find you watakupata wapi when it comes to youtube Now what should they expect? Um they'll find me on YouTube kama mm. Veronica. Mm. Uh, I'll be putting recipes, baking recipes mm. na my life lifestyle vlogs. Mm. Yes. Ah okay before uh to malizia malizia to kimalizia what is one thing the road love to do for her parents? Mm. Maybe ukipata do ama when you earn your first million. I'm already sure earn your first million. Bado. <laughs> What is that one thing you love to do for your parents? Um my parents have been very supportive mm. and I also want to say thank you so much to my mom and dad. So mm. Suleona pia alinia gaspuka. Yes. yes eh and I'm in a bed sitter, I'm a student. Oh. So wakanilia na I'm making money from that. Oh wow. Yeah. So I would love to build for them a house. Mm. Ni wapeleke majupi hao. Uh -huh. And my dad loves cars. Mm. So, 
kuangalia gari. Mm. Okay, very flexible build. Nyumba najua kabia atakuwa amechangamka maybe before that. Ama uta build kubwa. Ha, nita build kubwa. <laughs> Oh hey, wow okay that's nice and also apart from that can you describe a uh, kabi in three words three words yeah no matter two <laughs> it's um it's always funny he jokes a lot and uh, he's a very loving brother yeah. describe me in two words me she's a good sister she's talkative Ah. Mm. One thing uh, that you don't unajua kuna kwa sibling lazima kwazi kwa sa sibling rivalry. Kwanza between the see you guys are three. Kwenu. Mm. Right now which sibling is close to you? Shiro. Ah. <laughs> which sibling uh mnakwanga mekwaruzana kiasi? Si kukwaruzana but we don't talk a lot. It's happy. Really why? Eh uh, cuz you know acha tuko na gap kubwa. Yeah, yeah, mm. true, true. I remember Kabi saying before eh uh, ukuje alikuwa amekafa long time. Eh, so you know it's not that is. Yes. Big brother. Eh, ju acha nikiwa mkubwa alikuwa ashatoka huko. Mm-hmm. So, your bond ile bond bond bond. Mm. Okay, so as our basi as you're finishing up, can you talk to your fans? people who, are, who want to see more of uh Vero on social media where can they find you on social media or maybe if kuna kitu tumesahau you can also tell them oh so baby i wanted to say mm. kuna watu wamekuwa wakiniuliza kwa nini kabia alikuwa chukura so yes, yes. alikuwa anashinda sisi mbona alikuwa anasema hivyo mm. clarify mm. you know that time akiimba hiyo nyimbo ya bonoko yes. alikuwa amemaliza form 4 mm-hmm. na ni, nilikuwa mdogo lakini nilikuwa nasikia dada kimu zambono unyoe nywele mbona unyoe nywele anasema anataka kuwa so hapo ndio akakichingia hiyo nyumba ya bonoko hata hiyo time alikuwa na saiba with them come in amerentishwa saiba na dad na after ametoa hiyo video ya bonoko akamaliza si aka tafuta kosa nyaya tuka kufanya university aka enda kwa filming so kwenda kwa filming dada kamwambia uze hiyo saiba ame camera mm-hmm. eh so your allegations to kabi alikuwa chukura sikuli it's not true not you guys came from a good family whereby you are being taken care of eh yeah. oh okay 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 aha uh-huh, you had a question or well, maybe for the sake of the viewers bero atombe kama ako soko ama yuko soko <laughs> bero tell us people are watching na maybe tunaweza taka to kwe in law <laughs> Pero ayo uko soko. Kama uko soko, tuambie quality of a guy you want to get. Quality is here. Yeah. A respectful guy, mm. a very decent guy, mm-hmm. and a person who respects himself. Mm-hmm. Eh. Mm-hmm. Personality. Hakuna rich, ama unataka tu poor. Si, <laughs> yeah. Poor, ai, hapana. <laughs> Same to talk about cat cat when the children. Aha, so physical features. Esnanga hizo mambo za kuku. Hata kwa mfupi ni sawa. Eh, hakuna shida. Eh, eh, na ujasema god fearing. Eh, but the way god fearing akwa naomba sana. Si mara nimesahau eh, god fearing. Okay, maybe uh we you are to talk to your fans. I think tumemaliza kila kitu. Maybe talk to your fans. Um so like to just say I want to tell people mm. you know uki pata chance ya kukuwa venye uko kama content creation ikipeleke mm. juu yes. usiwai sawa watu wenye wako chini or kuadharau mm. unajua kuna watu watasema sijui house house manager it's not si wa class yangu mm. at sijui fake kuongea na house manager kwa nini nataka kwa unajua ni shey ambayo hivyo kwa nini nataka kwa house manager siku moja tunaongea na I made so I was like I know you know you are Jew usiwai darau watu wa chini tu great comes for fall na usiwai pia sahau kwenye you know that's a big statement kwa sababu trust me kuna wa Kenya hapo anaenda comment section anaenda kujijazia maneno clarify maybe okay when you what situation were you in ndo mtu akwambie if you are close to the maid you want to become a maid so the 
kulikuwa na issue so i was talking to the maid after ametoka huko mm. na nikauliza mbona naongea na yeye ni nini nini mm. at least sikuwa kuongea na yeye nani alikuuliza someone <laughs> tujue tu ni someone hapo eh mtu tu ni someone so mm. i was like i mm. kwani kuna kwanga ya mtu anakuwa na standards fulani mm. ama class tu yeah. kila mtu ni binadamu mm. na kila mtu ni wa Mungu mm. usiwahi kwa like ah huyu ni maid yes, yes. na naona yeah. kama hata aweza kitu mm. Mm. and talking about uh, ukiwa elevated also don't forget home maybe what can you insist when it comes to that because hiyo ndo nilisali ni kwa nauliza before because people have seen uh, you guys have been able to see where you guys stay you always see on social media right and uh, on this other side ya kina milito maana at least wamejengewa they are looking good so is that statement almost reflecting enye tunaongelea no i'm just advising people <laughs> here mhm <laughs> uh-huh. eh uh, so they say how queen eh and always be respectful to your parents. Yes. Usiwe kuna place imefika unasema sio wazazi wamekuchukia. Ndio mm. kwa mdogo alikulea, ukakuchinja taifa, ukakusomesha, ukaingia university, wakatitolea. Yeah. Yeah. So kuna place unafika, mm. ni kama unaona ati juu mtu mwingine amekuta kwa life yako anakuonyesha mm. ati familia yenyewe ikupendi, hapana. Mm. Yeah familia yeah. yako na kwa imekupenda kutoka wakulewa kusomeshe yeah. wakufanyie kila kitu yes. mpaka penye mm. umefika 